Welcome from Bonzolium Studios, Chicago, Illinois, USA. Not too far from 1728 Damon. In fact, I was born blocks from 1728 Damon back in 1969. Hmm. All right, so here's the deal. Anthony Costanza of the United States, East Coast somewhere, posted a picture last night, which was the penultimate day of 2018, of a giant beat, a 15-inch giant beat from Peisty, brand new, prototype sound edge bottom. It looks like it might finally be happening. Anthony, thanks for posting that. I said, Anthony, how did you get it? He said, Terry, you wouldn't believe it. I picked up my phone and I called my dealer and ordered one. <gasps> Who'd have thunk? So here's the deal. Anthony has one. There it is. He said it was the same price as, as he, he didn't have to pay extra for it. So let's keep our eyes on NOM 2018, Peisty at NOM in the next month. I think, they'll, I think they'll be there because I know there was another endorser or two that I talked to over the years who had mentioned ordering some from them and didn't get any, I don't think. But Eric, remember, Eric Peisty and I had a bromance that lasted about two weeks and three days where he said he was going to, you know, I, ta I told him how I'd been crying about making, Peisty making sound edge giant beats, well, pretty much since the week after they came out in 2005. And he said he was going to make and send me a pair. It never happened. But, so it looks like they're here. It looks like, I, I think so. I'm, I'm fairly certain if they cranked one out for no extra charge to just a client. Don't get me wrong. Anthony Costanza may have some special mojo. He might have gone to uh, Switzerland and like been like, Eric, you're going to make me. You know what I'm saying? But if you got, if a, re, if a person got one for a regular price, I have a feeling they're coming down the pipeline. It does say prototype on it. However, though, so you never know. But I do think this could be the year, 2019, the year of the sound edge giant beat. And it'd be wonderful if it was the year of the heavier than a multi-model. So this, remember, this multi I have, this 20-inch giant beat reissue multi is 1,818 grams. So like 1,800 grams. That's not heavy. That's not, that's thin for a 20-inch symbol. It'd be nice if they had like a 19, well, a 1,900 gram one and maybe even like a 1,980 gram. So maybe you could have two weights above the multi. So they have the thin on the 18 and 20 models, you could have the multi, which here it is. You have like the multi-medium, or the multi-plus, and then the multi-medium. The multi-plus might be 1,900 grams, and the multi-medium might be 1,980 grams. All right, so anyway, so this is here. This is my pair of Giant Beat Sound Edge hats that I made sort of in a Zildjian KZ type fashion. My top symbol is a, is a Giant Beat, a reissue Giant Beat Hi-hat top, 15 inches that I took from a pair I have here, and a 1976-2002 soundage bottom. I love them. Hang on here. Well, you can hear me, I think. I don't want this to... Well, let's just see. So... You know what it is? They're a little tight, though. Hang on. I think when Bonham tracked that, these weren't quite so... Hang on. There we go. So that's it. That's the announcement. Announcement. Giant beat sound edge hats coming down the pipeline. Could it be 2019 NAM coming up in a month? 15 inches of sound edge giant beat glory. Stay tuned. Thank you for watching.